Hi there, it's Lynn Como with Close to My Heart, and I'm very excited about offering my very first online crop retreat workshop, whatever you'd like to call it, for Seize the Day. It's going to be a great weekend where I'm going to show you how to cut and measure, teach you a few techniques. There'll be some um, drawings and a grand prize drawing as well. It's just a fun opportunity to get together while we're all stuck at home right now and to create some beautiful artwork for your vacation photos, beach photos. Maybe you'd love to go sailing. You go out on the water on a boat. Um, maybe you're going for a cruise or you've gone on a cruise and you really need to scrapbook those photos. I have the perfect opportunity and kit for you. So let me tell you a little bit about the event. It's going to be held on a Saturday, April 18th from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. and Sunday, 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. on the 19th. The cropping fee is only $25 with a purchase of a bundle as well. And I'm going to go over the bundle options that I have to offer. But you can see that there'll be um, different price points. I will have a file to share with you if you're interested, a grand prize and giveaways, cutting instruction, tips and techniques included. And I'm going to create a Facebook group to hold this event where you will be invited to join in. So I'm really looking forward to this and I would love to share with you the artwork that I'm going to be doing for this event. So hold on a second, let me pull that over. So let's talk about the different options, right? So first of all, one of the options would be just to do the workshop guide as well as two companion pages which I've created. So let me go over the products that are included in this option. Okay, we have the whole complete workshop kit which is beautiful and it creates uh, six pages. So I have changed it where it's um, eight pages completely done. We have some dots that are included in there and I'm going to show you the paper in the next video. Um, we're also, you would also want these beautiful shells. Can you see these shells? They're all self-adhesive and you get four in the kit that I've put together. You will want the embossing folder. The seashell embossing folder is just gorgeous. And we're gonna do some fun things with that. You'll also um, receive in that workshop guide, you get these acrylic pieces that say getaway and a few other things and so there's some hearts. We'll be using those. You definitely want the blue, sa the blue sapphire thread. We are using that throughout and these great Picture My Life cards. And I use Picture My Life cards in lots of different ways, not just as pocket cards, but they come in three by fours. You can see a bunch of different ones here, as well as four by sixes. So you can see as I go through them, and we might cut them out and do different things. Now, what else do you get? Well, we are using the Mixins paper pack. Now this Mixins paper is just gorgeous, I have to say. So that's included in this particular option as well. So you can see the pretty colors and I am using the smoothie, the canary, the gray lines, the mint dots and even some of the blue. And there's also one more sheet in here but that's for you to use on your own. You'll also need the um, coordinating cardstock in order for us to complete the kit. Now let's look at the gorgeous artwork that you're gonna create with this. So this is pages one and two right here. And you can see that I pretty much followed what the Close to My Heart guide had, which was gorgeous the way it was. I added some of those cute little seashells. And then this is the companion page that I designed. Now look at these beautiful, um, you know, post, that's what my idea was, something like a post, but I definitely textured them with some sanding and some of the, um, that embossing folder, which is so pretty to work with. I can use a little bit of the mix-ins papers as well. So really fun, fun, fun that you could do that. Now this is another layout that we will create and the sun, this part right here is a punch out. You get some great punch outs. Nothing is Cricut cut at all. So that's what I love about it. And we're using the mix-ins here. And then I made the companion page, which is right here, which is gorgeous. And tucking, I like the idea of tucking in a couple of photos, the picture my life cards we used, those little seashells, stickers, punch outs, all included in this kit. Gorgeous pages. This is really cute too. Maybe you are also going on a vacation, maybe you're going on a cruise, and I swapped out the charcoal paper. I liked using the softer color peach, 
and just added the embellishments that you see here and a picture of my life card right here. Really cute and I love the blue thread putting them through some of the anchors as well. And look at these waves. These waves are punched out and all you do is pop up a few of them to give them a little depth so that you can tuck some of the cute little elements behind it. Such adorable. And then seven and eight, seize the day. These are in here and I have a cute little tip to show you on how I did the chevron. They're punch outs, but I want to make it as simple as possible for me to put them together. Here's the getaway and all the different embellishments that you receive with the hearts and you get the clouds that are all punch outs. So these are the eight gorgeous pages that you can create with the workshop kit plus two. And that would be option number two on the guide that I've created. So I have a PDF file that shows you everything that I've used. So I think that's pretty much it on here. And I don't think I did any stamping on these pages. There to follow. So if you only have enough for one um, kind of program and you love this and this fits your pocketbook, this is one of the options. All right, what's option number two? Well, option number two is now I'm adding some stamps, okay? I love our scrapbooking stamp set. I live in New England and being close enough to the lighthouses and I love being out on the water. I love this stamp set and I use the thin cuts. Totally love it with the thin cuts that you get. That's optional. I mean, that is included in one of the options. I also use the Beach Treasures. Now, some of you might already own this because we used this in another kit a year or two ago and it's still available and it has thin cuts. So that's optional purchase. We are definitely using the die cuts. So you get that in this kit. We're still using the, um, all of these ideas, right? All of these pieces from that. And here's the pretty paper. This is the sticker sheet actually that comes in the workshop as well, but these are all peel and stick. And then these are the gorgeous papers for seize the day. This is seize the day uh, option number three, where you're making my eight pages. I designed the eight pages I'm going to show you as well as adding an extended story. So it's actually 10 plus pages and I can't wait to show you the artwork. I think you're going to love it. But aren't these papers gorgeous? We use a lot of our zip strips, the denim boards is what I call it. And then we have all the different shellfish. Love the red anchors. When you flip it over, it's the netting. And then you know you always have stripes, beautiful stripes at the sea, as well as water waves. So all of this comes in a kit, plus mix-ins. Now these are some of the ink colors that I definitely used with my stamps. I used the smoothie and the sapphire and the mink. Just a touch of canary, so if you have any yellow ink that works. Peach coordinates well with it, so you might want to add that to your collection. And you would use intense black only if you plan on stamping anything and coloring it in with watercolor pencils or tri-blend markers or watercolor paint or using a water brush. So those are optional things for you, but you don't have to. But definitely the top three are really important to have for this kit. All right, let's look at the artwork. Love these pages. The beach. Oh, let me show you this too. So this is an optional purchase. I love these thin cuts. These are alpha, new classic alphabet thin cuts that come with the full alphabet and the numbers. Okay. And this is on the list as an optional purchase. And that's what I used here. Now you might own something similar. You might have stamps you want to use. Uh, you also might use a Cricut cut. That's totally your choice of what you'd like to do. But these pages are gorgeous, and these are some of the Picture My Life cards here, some stickers, and I just had fun adding different em embellishments on these pages. You can see here's the die cuts here. Seize the Day, another gorgeous page, and um, actually it goes this way. And I did use watercolor brush, and I actually just used our sapphire ink to color that in. And you can use um, any marker you have or whatever you want to do the stripe or not do it at all. Love the birds that are in this stamp set. When you see the stamp set, you can see here's three birds, and you just put them on one block, and that will help get them clustered like that. So pretty. Love this page. This is my summer beach page. Fun in the Sun is a Picture My Life card where we cut it 
And then I used that embossing folder and we sanded it to get this textured look. And look at all those gorgeous shells. And we used the shimmer brush. The peach shimmer brush is also included in this workshop option where you could see I splattered it and then I also used it on the shells to get a little um, color there as well. And you can see all the different seashells that we use, the embellishments that we use, and more stamping with the seashells. So those are actually some optionals as far as the seashell stamp set because you might already have that. And then I also have these two pages. I really enjoyed playing around with this. You could put a title of your choice here. Uh, it could be Bon Voyage, or it could be it could be even a barbecue at the beach or a picnic at the beach, whatever you want it to be, a reunion of some sort. And I love the lighthouses, really fun. I love the colors and just a fun way to use the Picture My Life cards. So these are the first eight pages. Now I'm going into Extended Story. Now what's Extended Story? It's about telling a story of your event or it could be an excursion or I used it to tell a story about my summer so whatever works for you but I did Maine I live close to Maine but you could easily change this out to beach you can change this with whatever letters you want to do beach and you'll see I use the picture my life cards here and there's that stamp set love love the um, lighthouse and playing around with that so pretty. This is also stamped up here. This is a picture of my life card. So you have a 12 by 12 that gets, and then these get sandwiched in between in your album. And that is going to be part of another kit with the album, but you'll do all the same artwork. But you can see this is stamped here and there's that lighthouse again. And this is an eight and a half by 11. So that would go this way. And then this would be on top of it in between. Another great page to tell your story. And then we have a six by six. So we would have this one in between as well. So here's your six by six. And these are stamped with that beautiful stamp set. And then these are cut out of the Picture My Life cards. And then you also get some pocket pages. So this is a great opportunity to try something different and new. And this will hold six, uh, four by six pockets um, that are photos or we designed some of them. Now the C is done with that thin cut, that classic alphabet thin cut. So I'll show you how I, I did this look. I'll teach that in the video. And that's what's fun about doing a Facebook group is that I'm gonna be doing videos on cutting and the different techniques. And then that is something that is replayed back to you. So even if you can't be there physically on the 18th or 19th, you still wanna be a part of the crop, all the details, videos, instructions, photos will be available on that site for you to view on your timeline. But you can see how pretty these are. Now this is another pocket page that holds three by fours. So you can see some of it is stamped, just a picture of my life card. And this is also stamped down here, so we're using our stamps. And then it's sandwiched in the last page, which is this beautiful, um, 12 by 12, and I chose to do lake, but if you weren't going to do Maine and you wanted to do something that has to do with the beach, you could easily do the word swim or something of your choice. Just like instead of C, you could do sun. So whatever works best for you, you have that option to change it out or not use a title at all. But these pages are gorgeous. So this would be another optional purchase. Now, all of the details will be in a document that I will be sharing. And if you're um, watching me on YouTube, you can go to my blog, lincomo.com, and you'll see that that is where you'll find the detailed information. And if you're watching this on my blog, you will see that it's linked below this as a file for you to copy and, and print out or to, to look at. But you can see I've listed all of my options. So you're paying me $25 for the crop, and then you have your options of one, two, or three. And the first one is the album kit. Now all of this, everything that I've shown you, would be included in the album kit. You pick out an album, a 12 by 12 D-ring or postbound, and it comes with 10 page protectors. And you're also getting $25 in free product including, included in that. Another perk that you could add on for only $5 is the April stamp of the month. Isn't he cute? This is adorable and you could definitely use this. 
Now, some of my girls asked me about other stamp sets, and just letting you know, I have these listed as optional purchases, but you might like the card making stamp set with that bottle. Look how cute that is, right? Enjoy the journey with some waves and some bigger seagulls, and I like the compass and the paper that could you could pretend that goes in the bottle. So that is also adorable and coordinates well. And I have some card makers who would like to do a class on me teaching them how to use the cutting guide here to make the 16 cards with this adorable stamp set and thin cut. So that's another optional purchase for you. So if you are interested, all of the details will be in that guide, that PDF file that you print out with the different options and price points for you to participate. All right, listen, if you do have any questions, you can reach me at lincomo.com. Uh, you can also reach me through my website, lincomo.closetomyheart.com or ctmh.com, and ask me any questions you have. Let me know what I can help you with, and um, I really am looking forward to sharing this workshop date with you, or I should say this crop. And reminder is that if you're not on face group, uh, you're not in Facebook, I can also create a special place where I can upload all the videos and photos for you to partake on your timeline so that you still can do everything with us, but you're not on Facebook. So that's an optional purchase as well. Um, so it's only a $25 crop fee and it'll be a great event. I'm looking forward to sharing this with you and I hope to hear from you soon. Take care.